This is a huge European bumblebee. It's just hung out in my, uh, my house. I guess it got caught. It's probably dehydrated, but it's big. And I'm going to catch it. Alright, what I got here is some honey in my hand. I'm going to grab this bee. My fingers. Pull it right the frick off. And lay it right the frick down. Let's see if I can't get it to drink. Oh, sh I just dropped it right into a pile of it here. Get to turn around here. Yeah, he's pretty parched there. There, buddy, right there. Let's see, look at there he goes. Still got his proboscis. You can see it. And he's drinking away. Anyway, I can tell when an animal, an insect was parched. He's pretty big. One of the biggest ones I've seen. I think they're pretty placid, really. I mean, uh, even when he's uh, being picked up by his wings, you know. <laughs> Doesn't like it, but, you know, I didn't see his stinger stick out. He could. European bees, you know, I'm surprised. He's just very, very tame. Placid. So I'll give him a drink here of honey, some energy. And uh, send him on his way. Big. I mean, they really are. They just, uh, nothing really bothers them. Look at him, touching it, petting it. He's drinking away. About as close as I can get without losing focus. Center it. He's been drinking away. This is a uh, bee's honey from, uh, what is this? This is uh, Appalachian honey, actually. And he's drinking. He likes it. I do too, it's my favorite. Sour, uh, sour wood. Appalachian sour wood. All right, bud. Pet his head. <laughs> I mean, it takes a lot to get these uh, these bees angry, man. It's just really quite placid. Oh, there you go. Now he's, now he's done. Like a thing on pilot. Let's take him outside. High five. High B5. Come here. Oh crap. Getting angry. Alright, so let's come over here. Now he's pissed off. There you go, bud. He ain't letting go. Hooked in. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, that's all I needed, man. A little bit of incentive. 